Welcome. In front of me is a OnePlus 11 and today I'll show you how you can enable and also set up your portable hotspot. Now to get started, pull down your notifications, extend the list of toggles and locate the hotspot toggle, which for me is on the second page right over here. As you can see it's called personal hotspot. Now once you see it, you want to hold it first time around. And the reason you want to do this is, as you can see, it gives us a password right here. Now it is randomly generated, but what I actually recommend doing is selecting more and changing that password by going into the hotspot settings. Automatically it will select uh, your password, so you can just remove it and set up your new password. It will need to have at least eight characters in length, at which point you can save it. You can also change the hotspot name. This is just going to be the Wi-Fi name that will be visible in the list, but by default it is the name of the device, so it should be pretty easy to uh, recognize. Now below that we have a couple additional settings, uh, which if you know what they do, by all means change them to fit your needs, but if you don't know what they are, I would recommend keeping them as they are. And explaining this kind of section, for instance, like with the Wi-Fi 6 and AP bands, I could do it, but if you aren't aware right now uh, what these are, chances are once you have the other device that you want to connect with it, you most likely won't know what that device uh, supports. And I have no way of telling you what it supports because I have no idea what the device is. So by sticking with the lower options right here, so Wi-Fi 2.4 instead of the 5 gigahertz, you basically ensure that any kind of smart device that has any kind of Wi-Fi wi connectivity can connect to this hotspot. If you select it to 5 gigahertz, only the 5 gigahertz devices that support that kind of uh, AP band will be able to connect to it. So anything that only supports 2.4 is basically automatically excluded. That's why I recommend keeping it uh, as it is by default. Anyway, from here, once you change the settings, just make sure you tap right here on this checkbox to save the settings. And once you do so, it automatically also turns on your hotspot. Luckily, uh, we also have this toggle right here to automatically turn off hotspot uh, once it detects that no one has been using it for about 10 minutes. So I recommend keeping this on. When you forget about your hotspot, it won't be running indefinitely in the background with this setting on and you probably want to turn it off because hotspot will consume more of your battery life just by being enabled so like i said if you're not using it no point for it to be running in the background now we can close this and once you're done with your hotspot you can turn it off by finding the toggle tapping on it and the same way you can turn it on after you set it up there we go now if you found this very helpful don't forget to hit like subscribe and thanks for watching